when there is food in the small intestines, bile salts made from the liver can pass through the hepatic ducts into the common bile duct, where it will flow into the small intestine and emulsify the lipids of our diet. When there is no food in the small intestine, a sphincter at the hepatopancreatic ampulla closes. The bile which passes from the hepatic ducts through the common bile ducts backs up into the cystic duct and from there the gallbladder. The gallbladder concentrates the bile. Then, when there is food in the small intestine, the sphincter opens and bile can not only pass from the gallbladder through the cystic duct into the common bile duct, but also from the liver through the hepatic ducts to the common bile duct. Lipid droplets don't dissolve in the polar digestive juices. This also means that digestive enzymes cannot access the lipid molecules in the center of a droplet. But when bile salts emulsify lipids, they break big droplets into smaller ones, allowing the lipids to dissolve in digestive juices and for enzymes to access all of the lipids.